I don't have room for this. I don't have room for this. I don't have room for this. You know what I did. I'm trying to clean the old lab out and the new lab is pretty full and yeah, I had to get the bloody thing. Why? Why? And the damn thing works. It's a full color A3 LED an Oki MC852 printer and it works. It's absolutely perfect. I don't know how many, uh, well, we should uh, print the information. Actually, MC852, for those playing along at home, is absolutely enormous. Um, I, it, it, it can't fit in the lab. I mean, I, why? Why did I take it? Now the damn thing works, so it's like I'm not going to tear down a working damn printer. As much as it'd be interesting to see inside a, uh, like a lead printer, um, which I haven't uh, actually torn down a lead, um, uh, you know, printer before. And I've, I've got printers everywhere. Like, I've got this. This is going to be in my giveaway. I've got one over here. That's uh, prints brilliantly. Um, I've got probably got another one in here. The Epson I'm trying to get rid of. I'm trying to get rid of. Sorry about I'm shooting this on my phone. It's like 10 o'clock at night. I'm um, trying to get rid of this photo, this gigantic photocopier here, which you saw in the repair video. Unfortunately, since then, the uh, touch screen has come a gutter again. And um, anyway, oh, damn it. Damn it, it works. Um, the LCD contrast really sucks ass on this thing, but I can't get into the admin menu because it's got an admin password, so I have to like reset that. I've tried some basic ones, but uh, anyway. Um, so let's go into setup. Yeah, print count. How, many, how much is it done? There you go, it's done. Oh, 30,000, 80, oh no, 88,000 color. <laughs> Prints. That's a lot. Um, well, uh, well, it may not be for this type of printer. I don't know. Let me know. Um, sorry, the uh, contrast and the, see the flickering. You see the look at that. It's absolutely terrible, Muriel. So yeah, it's done a lot. But geez, the printout is uh, is spectacularly good. Aha! Uh -huh, reports. There you go. Information, configuration, MFP usage report, and we got the demo page. It worked fine. Let's print the usage report. Number of copies. Uh, <laughs> one. Thank you. Yes. Print in. Yeah, it's um full color A3 and it seems to print just fine. So, yeah, but I think weighs a ton. I reckon it's probably like 40 kilos or something. It was ridiculous. Uh, if not loaded with appropriate paper, yeah, yeah, resume printing. So I whacked A4 in it. And, uh, and it goes chug chug. Doesn't sound that healthy. Um, here we go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. What do we got? Uh, yeah, there we go. 88,000. Wow, 696 color. That's a lot. And 38,000. So, you know, well over 100,000. So, anyway, leave it in the comments down below. Let me know. Um, I, I can't. I mean, it prints well, but geez, I've got nowhere to put it. The thing is, like, it is so deep. Like, I, like the scale. Um, I, I need a banana for scale. Um, sorry, don't have one, but yeah, it, it doesn't fit on my trolley. Um, like, well, it, it fits, but it hangs off the edge and it hangs off the end. That's how big this damn thing is. And, uh, you know, it's got the Ethernet things. That, what is it? It's probably like a 10-year-old model or something, but it's got... Good old Centronics, um, but it does have the Etherwebs. Um, and of course it's got, you know, your regular faxy thing in it. And, uh, uh, oh geez, like A3, A3, oh, you know, I, I don't have room for it. I've got to show you a tour of the new lab. Um, oh, there we go, I can adjust the, oh, oh, contrast, there we go. I should have just hit that before. Dolt, there we go, beautiful. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Oh, damn it. Oh, well, I'm not going to put it back in the dumpster. I, I wouldn't dare tear down a working printer like that. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Should I give this one away as well? Oh, maybe I can go measure that. I mean, this could probably do everything. Or, like, I can do away with multiple printers if I just have this one. Um, so, yeah, it's one of these all-in-one whiz-bang thingamajigs, but... Oh. 
bloody working shit in the dumpster. I don't know, how dare people throw out perfectly working stuff. And because I know people are going to want the toner information, uh, black toner, um, 100%, 100%. It's only the magenta that's um, mysteriously 50%. So, I don't know, they got some third party thing in there. Anyway, the drum, the belt uh, is down to 31%. Fuser, 53 Everything out the drums are all 97% because they probably changed the drums with the, uh, um, the actual toner, don't they, usually? I don't know about these Oki ones, but anyway. Yeah, it looks like it'll um, just keep chugging along for quite a long time. And I'm running a copy on it just to see if the copy works sort of you know it doesn't sound that great but uh, has it come out has it popped out and yep beautiful that's the that's the printout no oh, that's that's the copy that's the original the original copy it's absolute bobby dazzler um yeah, anyway, high definition color, like, looks like really deep rich color too. Oh, I just don't have the damn room for the thing. Oh, my lab's already practically chocker. Oh, I'm gonna go with a measuring tape and oh, I don't know. It's all too hard. Catch you next time.